Things are about to get dicey. So, men, how's it going? Everything's fine, Lieutenant. Nothing to report. All our friends are quiet. Perfectly quiet. As soon as they hear about a silver coin, they start trembling. Good. It would be a shame to have to make another example of them, right? Oh, there's no need, Lieutenant. They've been as sweet as lambs since... Renault's accident. Accidents happen so quickly. I'm waiting for another delivery today. Have you seen your comrades? No, they must have stopped at the tavern on the way. As soon as we see them, we'll send them your way, Lieutenant. I hope those idiots aren't drinking my gin. No one would dare do that to you, Lieutenant. I hope not. Well, I'll have to remind them that the silver coin can shake everyone, even the guards. Well, I'll leave you. I have urgent business to attend to. Now, don't forget to send me those drunkards. Farewell, Lieutenant. There is no doubt. Here is our man. Let's follow him discreetly.
Who are you? You're following me. Indeed. We would like to talk to you about the silver coin, Egon. Egon? <laughs> you must be mistaken. I don't know anyone by that name. Do not take us for fools. We heard you speak with your men. I don't know what you've heard, but you're wrong. I'm not Egon. Regardless, you are implicated in a murder and in the extortion of merchants. You are therefore under arrest. And we will finish by having you tell us who Egon is and where to find him. Oh yes, we'll see about that. So, have you finally decided to follow us? So you can torture me? You can do whatever you want. I'll not tell you anything. I don't know who Egon is. I'm just a middleman. You're wasting your time. You must know more than you're willing to say. Come on! I'd rather die. <laughs> The coin, his symbol of recognition. I have to show it to Manfred. Cousin, you have returned to me. Your absence was sorely felt. We don't appear to be in top form. A house intrigue's keeping you from finding proper sleep. No, nothing to bring me nightmares as of yet. I'm blaming it on the change of diet. Now, tell me what adventures you've been up to. If you only knew how bored I grow behind these walls. We were not able... Alas, to stop the clash between the forces of the Alliance and Siora's clan, we arrived at the village and the battlefield too late. The Queen fell. I'm extremely sorry for your loss, Princess. Thank you. My sister survived, fortunately, and we are recovering from this tragedy together. But our clan was extremely weakened by this battle and by recent events. We shall keep a close eye on the Bridge Alliance and their undertakings. Rest assured. You should know that the battle took place in the middle of ancient ruins. The ruins were quite strange. We discovered a fresco that I'm certain was crafted by continental hands. Really? And how ancient are these ruins? Could they date back to the first landings of the Bridge Alliance? They date much farther back than their arrival would explain. My mother and my grandmother have always known them. Siora told me of a legend that spoke of them, about a people from the sea that were vanquished there. Do you think it was the Norts? It is not our custom to found a landlocked settlement. We have our islands and it is enough for us. If they are ancient, perhaps your people once practiced older customs. 
This story is troubling, but it reminds me of something that I once read in the reports of Lady Morange. You should go and find her. Perhaps she could tell us more about them. Very well. Anything else? Any news of your parents? No. With the time it takes to travel to the continent, it's not surprising. But I don't miss them. My father's next letter will certainly be full of his usual disdain. As for my mother, you know her. She's probably too busy planning her next assassination to have noticed my absence. I'm going to leave now. Goodbye, Constantine. Look out for yourself. Sir de Corsillon. The Sade, my young student. What can I do for you? Don't worry. I will take care of indexing the location suitable for setting up camp. Glad to hear it, de Sade. I look forward to seeing your map. Can your old professor still prove himself useful? Looking forward to seeing you again, Sir de Corsillon. Good day, Lady Morange. Do you remember me? Of course. Sir de Sardé, isn't it? I hope that you and your cousin have grown to like it here. But I have little reason to believe you have paid me a visit to exchange civilities. Can I be of service? What do you know about the ruins found to the northwest of here? <laughs> the site that the natives call Didakidnadagase. That is not how we pronounce it, but yes, we are speaking of the same place. <laughs> your language is difficult to master, but I find it fascinating. Uh, to answer your question, I had countless questions about the place when our explorers and scouts first brought back sketches. Intrigued, I went there. I noted the architecture and their decorations. It is certain that they bear a striking resemblance with continental constructions, but they are more ancient. Too old to have been recently built by the Bridge Alliance settlers when they first set foot on the island. I even questioned the natives, but they only spoke of a people of the sea. My first thoughts went to the Norts, but they're not known for building large towns, less so cities. There are other ruins on a cliff to the east of here. Perhaps they hide the key to this mystery. I hoped to organize an expedition, but the region is dangerous and hard of access. We explored mines at the bottom of the cliff, but we were not able to find an access to the plateau. 
If the mystery of these ruins intrigues you as much as me, it is in that direction that you should begin to look for answers. Can I help you with any other matter? My lady, I have to go. Goodbye. Lady Morange said the ruins would be around here. She must have been talking about Deidre. Lady Morange told us about, but I do not know how to get there. The path collapsed. Some of the tunnels in the mine may lead to it. We should go there. Yeah! yeah. 
some unusual customers. <laughs> well, I have everything a miner could need. And everything. Here's the entrance to the mine. It may be worth talking to the villagers. Good day. What can I do for you? What can you tell me about the ruins on the plateau? You aren't the first to ask me about them, but the answer is still the same. I've nothing to tell you. Not that I wouldn't want to, but I've never been there. There must have been a path once upon a time, but it's no longer there. Maybe it collapsed. Some say that you have to pass through the mines to get there. A few of the tunnels do climb. It's certainly possible, I would say. But those tunnels are all closed, and we have better things to do. The iron ore. It doesn't come out of the ground by itself. Do you need anything else? Talk to me about the mines. It wasn't us that first dug them out. They're really old. Centuries old. But those tunnels are full of riches. It takes little effort to unearth the minerals that we want. What more could we ask for? As seeing as how there aren't that many of us, if we were pressed to mine all the tunnels, we'd be too few. But the time will come when folks hear about what we're pulling from these rocks. We won't be alone for much longer. Hello. You lost? No. Why do you ask? It's just that we rarely get visitors. Well then, what can I do for you? What can you tell me about the ruins that we can see up there? Uh, not a great deal. To my knowledge, no one's ever been able to reach them. There were some officials from the city that came, but when they saw they couldn't easily climb up to the plateau, they just left. There must have been a path that caved in. Unless some sort of tunnel in the mine takes you there. Anything else? What can you tell me about the mine? It's ancient work. The natives must have dug it out a long time ago and then abandoned it. Even if it is strange work for islanders, it looks more like something we would do on a continent. We're trying to restore it. The rock is extremely rich in iron ore. But the tunnels are very old. You need to go slowly. None of us are in a humor to be buried alive. We did explore a few of them, and we're exploiting the closest. But others, nah, they're still inaccessible. Anything else? If I got this right, this hamlet is home to only miners? Yes. It's not been all that long that we've taken up residence here. For the time being, we've only been working a part of the mine because the veins run so deep in the tunnels. Hopefully, more miners will come, and that will attract other craftsmen to our village. We'll see. Anything else? I'll leave you to it, then. Until we meet again.
gate. We must find out how to open it. Oh, the door is blocked. The mechanism that controls it is complex. And as would be expected, it is missing a part. I can't do that.
some unusual customers. <laughs> These are some unusual customers. <laughs> Greetings, my lord. It's a real pleasure to have a customer such as yourself. How may I help you? I imagine that your customers are mostly miners. Yes. For this reason, I mostly sell supplies and tools. But as you can see, I have some other riches. <laughs> I'm sure this village will eventually grow larger. <laughs> Who knows? Maybe this alley will become more lively. Thank you. It was a pleasure. We can resume our journey.
Finally, here we are. These are the ruins that Lady Lorene spoke to us about. And she was right. These do not resemble native constructions at all. Explore the area. Something may give away the identity of the architects. This seal, I know the insignia, even if it has become more detailed in recent decades. It's hard to believe my eyes. What you're seeing doesn't seem to please you. This is the ancient coat of arms of Serene. It's a congregation seal. Let's continue to dig. I need to know more. I need to understand.
This seal. I know the insignia. Even if it has become more detailed in recent decades. It's hard to believe my eyes. What you're seeing doesn't seem to... This is the eight mil. Let's continue. This journal confirms what we suspected. A continental nation had once attempted to colonize the island with the help of the Nords, and they were repulsed. From what I was able to decipher, few of them actually managed to escape. Hmm. The major part of the journal has faded, and I'm not able to decipher the name of the author. I don't think we'll learn anything else here. No possible doubt remains. All the clues point in the same direction. 
The people from the sea who built these ruins and confronted the natives, they were us. It's difficult to admit. And to think that I turned to you to help us against the Bridge Alliance. I do not judge you guilty of the crimes of your ancestors, but this story is known. I know. This will not help our relations with your people, that is certain. Goes to show that times change. To think that you were once conquerors. You're gonna have to pay me more for protection. If it comes out, then we're those who see red. Oh, this must be the reason they kept us in the dark. But Constantine is gonna be furious when he learns this. On all Manawi, my mother is still held in this outpost near the Gigador. I must do everything I can to free her from the lion's claws. So will you accompany me? Maybe later. I have no time to take care of this at the moment. I understand. But do not wait for too long. They may be hurting her. Anything else? I must leave you. See you later. Cousin! You have returned! How did things go? Oh, you don't look well. What's happened here? Nothing. Nothing terribly bad in any case. I must have eaten something that's having trouble going through me. Seems to me that this illness has been lingering too long. Who prepares your meals? Are they safe? No one is poisoning me, dear cousin. We are far from court and their customs. It's nothing. Take my word for it. Now then, what do you have to tell me? We had a talk with Lady Morange, and we explored the ruins that she suggested we visit. 
All our findings point to one conclusion. Those ruins were originally built by the Congregation of Merchants. The Congregation? Us? But Father never once even hinted. Once again, he must have deemed me unworthy to know the secret. How he must despise me. A Constantine. We have other more immediate matters at hand. Have you met the island governors? Did they speak of their discoveries concerning the Malachor? No, I have not as of yet been able to carry out that mission. I know I have put a great deal on your plate, but this mission is of the highest importance, cousin. I'll get right to it. Have no further concerns. Anything else? I'm going to leave now. Goodbye, Constantine. Look out for yourself. <laughs>